Hi guys, uh, back again with another video. Now this video is going to be a haha, waterproofness test of the MI Band 4. So uh, we will be testing it in sea water to see if anything happens to it. We'll be taking it to the swimming pool anyways. We'll be putting it into 5 meters of water and see if it's going to work. But sea water is not recommended for any of these devices. So we are going to see if it is going to survive sea water. So I'm just going to sit here. I'm not going to go for a swim. So I'll just sit here with the waves. And then hope, <laughs> and hope I don't get a lot of big waves on me. My eyes are burning. Okay, so my hand is in. Let's sit there. Okay, still working. So uh, I've actually used it for a few, uh, few hours in the water before, and it worked fine. So no problems. Uh, I'll be doing the other test, and then in the end we'll see if it is still working or not. So let's go. Okay, so you've seen the sea test. Now let's go ahead and put it in the swimming pool for 10 minutes, and then see if it's going to survive. Most of the bands do not survive this 10 minutes uh, challenge. Uh, like the new Samsung Fit E failed, the Lenovo Cardio failed, uh, even though all of them boasted a big uh, waterproofness uh, uh, rate, but it did not work. So let's hope this one survives. The MI Band 2 and 3 did survive. Uh, let's see if the 4 survives the swimming pool test or not. So we're gonna uh, put the stopwatch on a different phone, switch it on here. Uh, damn it, water, water everywhere. Touch screen zone work. Okay, so I'm gonna switch on the stopwatch. I switch it on, keep it here, throw it in the water. So it's in. So let's keep our fingers crossed that it doesn't go. It's too expensive, so many tests to do. Don't want it to die right now. So hope that doesn't go bad. Okay, so I'm going for a swim now. See you back in 10 minutes. Okay, 10 minutes up. Let's get the band. Forgot to wear the glasses. Okay, Let's keep our fingers crossed. Wow! So it's working. Okay, it's all well. Okay, so it's still working, no problems, uh, everything is working fine. Now let's take it to the steam room and see how good it's going to be in the steam. So we'll be in the steam room for another 10 minutes and then see if it's still going to work. Let's go. Okay, so we're doing the steam room test now. So the steam is on, uh, let me just show you. The steam is on, just switched on. So we're gonna keep the uh, MI Band 4 in here for another 10 minutes. We're gonna start the stopwatch here again and then uh, see if it's going to survive the steam. So let's start it. Now the time is 6.37, so exactly in, uh, at 6.47 we should be taking it out. So that's the van, and we're in the steam room now. So let me just keep it next to the steam itself, here. <coughs> and let's wait for 10 minutes now. So let me change the angle, uh, let me show you the van itself. So that's the band. Two minutes thirty seconds over. Nice. 
9 minutes 30 seconds, 30 more seconds to go. Stay alert. Okay, 10 minutes are up. Whew. Hopefully you can see that. 10 minutes are up. Let's stop the stopwatch, take the band and go out. A lot of steam. Okay. A lot of steam. So the band is still working, no issues. So I've already tested it in the steam room a lot of times. I've been using this. Uh, I mean, I, when I make my videos, I make sure that for at least one week I test my devices. So it has already been tested for one week, so uh, no issues. So if you take it to the sea, if you take it to the swimming pool, or if you take it to the steam room, nothing is going to happen to your MI Band 4. So they made it even more rough and tough than the previous version. So that's basically it. If you want uh, any other queries to be answered, uh, do message, uh, do comment, uh, do send me messages on uh, Facebook Messenger or Instagram and I'll be replying back to that. So that's it for this video. If you like the video, please subscribe, hit the like button and do comment and I'll see you again with another video. Bye-bye.